Let's look at an example of how to calculate a paycheck after deductions. Here we're told Allison's monthly salary is $31.24.47. And she has three deductions, income tax of $538.63, federal insurance of $237.49, and health insurance of $159.53. Now there are two ways you can go about calculating this. You can either subtract each term individually from the salary amount, or you can sum all of the deductions and subtract that sum from the salary amount. If you go with the first method, you have three operations, three subtractions. If you go the second way, you just have one addition and one subtraction. So we're going to go with the second method. So to do this, we're going to sum up all three deductions here. They are 538, 63, 237, 49, and 159.53. So we'll add these up. 3, 9, and 3 is 15. Carry the 1. 1, 6, 4, 5 is 16. Carry another 1. 1, 8, 7, 9 is 25. Carry a 2. 2, 3, 3, 5 is 13. Carry a 1. 1, 5, 2, 1 is 9. So all the deductions together are 935.65, and we'll subtract this number now from the salary amount. So we have 31.24.47, and we're subtracting 935.65. 5 out of 7 is 2. 6 out of 4, we're going to have to borrow from this 4, so this becomes a 3. This becomes a 14. 6 from 14 is 8. 5 from 3, we're going to have to borrow again. We'll take this down to a 1, and this will become a 13. 5 from 13 is 8. 3 from 1, we'll borrow again. This becomes a 0, this becomes an 11. 3 from 11 is also 8. 9 from 0, borrow one more time. That becomes a 2, that becomes a 10. 9 from 10 is 1, and we have a 2 right there. So Allison's monthly paycheck amount is going to be 2188.82.